Okay, a cannonball is shot straight up with a with an initial speed of hundred meter per second. How high does it go? Okay, so what kind of motion is this? Right, this motion is uh, you say is shot straight up. Shot straight up. That means uh, this one is only involve uh, y component. So we can say this is a free fall motion or projectile at ninety degree. Okay, uh, oh, which uh, which it only has a y component. Now initial speed. Uh, this is the u initial speed. And then he says straight up, yeah, up. So that means uh, the initial velocity is positive hundred. Ah, uh, okay. Ah, uh, uh, because uh, the direction of motion is going up, so the initial velocity is positive hundred. How high does it go? So the question asks about height, yeah, height. So this is the dis displacement in y component. Okay. Ah, uh, so for free fall motion, okay. For free fall motion, we know one thing. Uh, the acceleration is negative g. Okay. Uh, this is uh, the acceleration in y component. Uh, and then uh, we also have the you know initial velocity. Uh, this one also velocity in y component. Uh, and then we want to find displacement. Okay. How high does it go? That means how high. Uh, the the ball the ball will reach a maximum height, isn't it? Will reach a maximum height. So the ball actually free fall motion, yeah, going up, going slower and slower and slower and slower and slower. Finally, at the maximum height, the velocity is zero. Ah, velocity is zero. Okay, uh, this is what we know. So at the maximum height, uh, this happens. The velocity is z. The velocity in y component is zero when maximum height uh do at maximum height okay so this is actually we want to find the maximum height yeah which is the y displacement okay so uh we have a we have u we have v we need to find s so v u a s was uh, what's what's the was formula we can use was formula yes v square equal to u square plus Two a s okay. Uh, so the velocity is zero at the maximum height. Okay, velocity is zero at the maximum height. And then initial velocity is a uh, hundred. Okay, hundred meter per second. And then uh, square and then two times uh, a is negative g. Uh, remember g. G itself is a positive value, yeah? Positive 9.81. Remember that. Okay, so continue, continue. Uh, we want to find the displacement, yeah? The displacement. Alright, so, um, okay. Negative, uh, right? And then, this is uh, negative 2 times, okay? The negative we put outside. Uh, G is uh, 9.81, nah? There's no negative for G. G itself is a positive value. Uh, so find the displacement S. Okay. So what's the displacement in S? Comp uh, S? Yes. So the answer is um, the answer is five hundred and nine point six eight meter. Ah, that's it. So is the is the answer correct? Yes, five zero nine point six eight meter. So this is the this is the maximum height. Uh, that it goes. Yeah, maximum height it goes. Uh, when the final velocity at the maximum height is zero. Okay, that's the answer.